Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, and today I'm doing some PvP with the Falchion. Quick shout out at the start here to some new patrons. We have Joshua Morris and Game Rave, who also has a YouTube channel focusing on vintage games and such. So the Falchion, with the Sharp Infusion, gets an A scaling in Dexterity. I have 58, giving me an attack power of 429, so that's more than the scimitar, but it does not get, as far as I know, the same super quick moveset that the scimitar does. I mean, it's the same moveset, but the attack frames, I think, are better on the scimitar. Anyways, still pretty good. I'm pairing it with a short bow, and my armor is Ragged Mask, Eastern Armor, Desert Pyromaster Gloves, and Shadow Legs, with the Rings of Favor, Life, Florenthy and Karthus Milk Ring. Let's get started with the PvP. Our opponent has a giant lightning sword. Probably the Lothric Knight. If I had to guess, that's what I'd say it would be. That was awesome. Looks like Dragon Slayer Ornstein. Pretty cool. Thought he was gonna poke me there. 801 damage. <laughs> 44. I'm pull out the arrow. Just to. Oh! How dare you! Hit me with a projectile with while well, I'm trying to hit you with a projectile. <laughs> Ran myself out of stamina. The rolling attack on that one-handed falchion is so good. I mean, it's all the one-handed curve swords, really. Two-handed, you just gotta try an R2 or a weapon art. Hope to get a catch. Oh, come on. The standard running attack. Old reliable. And we're going up against a Black Knight. This could be tough. We've got poise and some high damage weapons. You know what? I never did a weapon with that axe. Or a video with that axe. Wow, I'm surprised that missed. And there's the R1 R1 weapon art combo. Which is an R1 R1 L2 R2 combo, I guess. I wanted to switch his moveset, I suppose, is why he switched that out. No parry for you! Yo, old friend. Or in this case, enemy. Ooh, I did not think that was going to hit me. Mostly because it didn't hit me on the screen anyways. <laughs> Ooh, he gave me life. Mercy. Or he just didn't hit the button. <laughs> Missed his parry. Praise be Gwen's beard. Hit. But annoying with these arrows now. Wow, <laughs> that strategy works, but not if you only have one sliver of health. So it's the curved sword against the great curved sword, <laughs> or the curved great sword, I guess I should say. Well, that did not work out. 
Oof. You got me good there. Ha ha! I thought he was gonna rush me. <laughs> they had the bow. Got him with the R2 though. That was one heck of a combo. Kinda looks like the armor I used for the Keeper of the Old Lords. I don't remember Havel's gauntlets being on. Oh, I didn't expect that R2 to hit him. I should have went for the R1. I'm pretty sure the R2... I haven't tried it with the Falcon, but I'm pretty sure the R2 is going to chain right into an R1. It seems like... He goes right for an attack afterwards. Got rid of his tears. Ooh, he's got some regen too. Otherwise that... Should have killed him. Hit him right in the ring. I knew he was going for the parry. I was just so far away from him. There we go. <laughs> Good game. We found Loglad and his great flaming log. Crushing evildoers with the power of wood and flame. Ouch. Oh, got out. Oh man, that was close. Oh god, that was so close. If I had a little more stamina... Our opponent has Leto's and Smoes. This... <laughs> not something you see every day. Oh wow, that hit me. Oh man, this is hilarious. Okay, and he disappears as quickly as he appeared. Does our opponent have the witch's locks? I think so. And he's got a straight sword. That's got to be a good combo. And that stupid pillar got me again. <laughs> Trading hits. I hope we got more damage. It's hard to say. And I just... <laughs> Threw my throwing knife at the pillar, because I'm so mad that it unlocked me. Ooh, tricked him with the weapon art. Good game. Looks like our opponent has the Stora Greatsword and the Lothric Knight Longspear. Oh, I didn't even get my running attack in there? Oh, only one hit. Now he's gonna try to poke me to death. Not if I poke him with arrows! Oh, look at that headshot. My word. Alright, he's coming in. Got him aggressive. I just need to switch to this sword. Oh, oh, oh so close. Look at that arrow on his head. <laughs> Opponent's got a flaming ultra great sword. We hit him with a running attack. Oh, 
Oh, what is the Stora great sword? Man, I gave it to that guy. It is curve sword against flaming curve sword. Oh, he's got a dark hand too. Nice. Wow, we're just doing the same attack. Alright, I got a nice weapon art in there. And then I threw a knife at the ground. Got that rolling R2 as well. Wow, look at that Centurion setup. Uh, it doesn't get better than that. Man, that was close. Ooh, got me good. Really good. Looks like the armor of thorns and the loin blade. Man, we did a lot of damage right at the start there. Got his red tear stone activated. Or is that just Morian Blade? It's probably both. I don't know why it wouldn't be both. Not that it matters, because he's dead. Our opponent has the ring of divine favor and protection and gale. Wow. <laughs> Trading my fully charged R2 and his weapon art R2. Hey. I did not expect that to happen. Ah, tears of denial. And some HP regen. What is up with this? I guess people always use <laughs> tears of denial. I shouldn't be surprised. Pulling out the rapier now. I'm gonna pull out the bow, see if that messes with him at all. I guess not. Thought I could switch out and confuse him. No luck there. Got him with a good running attack though. Oh, <laughs> if I just hit the button and didn't hold it down, I would have blasted him with that R2. And that was a bad idea. <laughs> oh my god, that was so close. Good game. Let's see, Havels with Morn's Head, Tears of Denial, and what weapon? <laughs> oh, the Scimitar. The smaller yet better curve sword. No, it's the Follower Saber. I don't think that one has the better moveset. She went for the R2. <laughs> that was a bad idea. Oh. This is Moose Torrent, and I'll be back with another video for you guys shortly.